Wow, look at this. Mm. Our own wall of fame. That's right, own wall of fame. Jeffrey. One year later, looking dapper. Mac looking like a superstar already. <laughs> the wonder kid, Olawale. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Nobody expected him to That's win, all right? very unassuming, you know, but he just comes adorable, but endearing himself as people. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The man with the swag. I know. He's wearing cheetah pants in this picture <laughs> with a suit jacket. Who does that? <laughs> <laughs> Only Ayola. She uh, looks so different and beautiful mm -hmm, now. I mm -hmm. absolutely love the low-cut look. Mm -hmm. And I also feel like she's really evolving into herself, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. yeah. By the day. And this is one person I'm very proud of. She's grown. Mm -hmm. She's grown. She's she's broken out of that little shy girl, yes. you know? She's a bit more risque now. Yes, right. That's right. You know, right. kissing That's flavor in videos. And all of that stuff. <laughs> we see you do your thing, Chidama. Mike. The kid with a lot of energy. I remember his performance from last year. I was really surprised, mm. pleasantly surprised. Mm. I mean, he has so much energy and stage presence. Yeah, he just electrifies the stage. He's rebranded himself. Yeah. Hi, Mike. Yeah. And of course, last but not least, the couturier master himself. The guy who started it all. Mm hmm. Now, a super duper star. Yes. Mm. You know, that's the thing about this, the, the Academy. Just, they all come in their role forms, you know? They discover themselves, their mm -hmm. voices, their sound, and they just blossom. They just yes. blow out, you yes. know? It's, it's interesting. Honestly, it just gladdens my heart. And it's so exciting because mm -hmm. this is our very own wall of fame right. from MTM Project Fame West Africa. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Balanle Olukani. And I am Joseph Benjamin. This is MTN Project Fame West Africa Season 8. I'm sure that you can tell it's a whole new vibe on the show this season. We're here for some serious business. As you can see, Joseph and I addressed the part. That's right. And the judges are taking no prisoners. In fact, you can call it a battle for survival, as you won't be wrong, because these 24 contestants will be singing their hearts out today for a chance to make it to the next stage. And, of course, the final verdict belongs to our judges. Speaking of which, let's welcome our esteemed panel of judges in no particular order, starting with Day Bantu. And, of course, next up, we have the lovely BB Brew. Last but certainly not the list, the ever fly looking TY mix. Well, we're gonna hear from our judges later on. We wanna find out what their expectations are for this season. Welcome back to Project Fame West Africa Season 8. Now, before we hear from our top 24 contestants, we want to find out what our judges are thinking. What are their expectations for this season? So I will start with you, T.Y. You're looking very wonderful as well. Thank you very say. much. T.Y., what are you thinking is going to happen this season? What are your expectations? Well, to be honest, I'm expecting a lot of surprises. Um, I want to be um, beyond normal. I want to be excited about the show. I want to be excited about the quality of artists that we have. I want to be excited about the showmanship. I want to have a good time. What is that thing that you're looking out for? Because there has to be something that stands out for you. Well, to be honest, they're getting better. Mm. They know the game now. So it makes it harder for us. Mm. So we're not really sort of like looking out for like early days. We're looking for real, genuine talent that needs to be polished. Mm. We're looking for uh, the part of them that wants it so much. So much. You understand? Mm. And also the, the natural showmanship and all those kind of things because it takes time to bring it all out. Are you going to consider those people who maybe their nerves got the best of them? Maybe they didn't do their song correct song choice, you know, because they picked the songs today. I don't think it's about technical perfection. We can work on that. But I want a voice that shows a lot of promise, a voice that is already exceptional in terms of the tonality and the texture, where I can see something exceptional come to light, you know. And ultimately, what I want on this show is exponential enjoyment, you know. I want triple A games. Well, that's it. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, judges. Well, we'll go for a quick commercial break, and when we come back, we'll find out if our judges' expectations will indeed be met. Don't go away. My name is Jacqueline Martins Okolia. I graduated from Abia State University with a BA degree in English Literary Studies. The song I'm doing for the semifinals is Suddenly by Billy Ocean. I actually dedicated that song to myself. Hi. This is Jacqueline Martins Okolie in Project Fame West Africa Season 8. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello, good day. Hi. Oh, Hello. we just so happy to see you. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hello. 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 Hello.
Wow. really beautiful wow. thank you so much yeah thank you so much wow like you know you know she actually got my heart racing like yeah. you know like i don't know why you know but that actually gets me pretty confident right now. yeah but that's a beautiful song and a well chosen song for your voice type and uh, the way you rendered it was so perfect that's a good addition song the song i chose for the semi-finals is redemption song by bob Mali. I would, I would really do well with this song, so I think that was why I chose the song. My name is Jeff Ako, West Africa, watch out for me. What song are you singing today? I'm singing Redemption Song by Bob Marley. Wow. Is it your own version or...? My own version, yes. Okay, your own interpretation, yeah. I believe. Are oh. you an artist already? Do you sing? Or I sing. You, you're a singer? Yes. All right. So, um, we're eager to hear your version. Old pirates, yes, they're all by. Sold I to the merchant ships. Minutes after they took I from the bottomless pit, but my hand was. By the hand of the Almighty, we fought in this generation triumphantly. Won't you help to sing this song? of freedom cause all I ever had redemption songs songs of freedom redemption Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> You're not taking oh any goodness. prisoners there for sure. Oh my goodness. Wow. My lord. That was very, very good. I like the fact that you um, you went straight up all the way. You um, there wasn't you were you weren't restraining yourself or anything. You just let go and you connected to the essence of the song, to the spirit. You know the soulfulness. You took it away from reggae. You took it away from Bob Marley. You told us the story behind the song in your performance and the vocal dexterity, the control. Yeah. I, I could feel it. I'll be doing Hello by Lionel Richie. And um, I hope to give my best for the song. I, I hope to do a lot better than I did during the auditions. Uh, it's your boy, Olabanji Henry, and I'm here on the show again. I promise not to leave anytime soon, and I need your support every time so I can be here. I need to be invited on Saturday. I'm going to leave you alone. I'm going to leave you alone. I'm going to leave you alone. I'm going to leave And in my dreams, I've kissed your lips a thousand times. I sometimes see you pass outside my door. I long to see the sunlight in your hair. And tell you time and time again how much I care. I sometimes feel my heart will overflow. Hello, I've just got to let you know. Cause I wonder where. Are you somewhere feeling lonely? Or is someone loving you? Tell me how to win your heart. For I haven't got a clue. But let me start by saying, I. I love you. Hello, West Africa. Hello, everybody. My name is Esther Mondi. I'll be performing Tony Braxton's How Could an Angel Break My Heart. I hope I'll be convincing enough to the judges so I could pass into um, the academy. I want to do a shout out to my family, my mom, I love you, my dad, I love you, my siblings and my friends, everybody that has supported me so far. I just want to say a very big thank you to you all. I love you. I heard you sing a lullaby. I heard he sang it from his heart. Oh yeah, when I found out the lion time because the lullaby was mine
Thank you. Hello, my name is Dorothy Ohiani. I am 23 years old and I am Nigerian. The song that I will be doing is Hero by Mariah, Mariah Carey. And I picked the song because the lyrics are very um, empowering. Hello, everyone. Hello, West Africa. To my fans, to my family, and to my friends. I'm here to stay, and I'm going to try my hardest to make all of you proud. So just listen and enjoy. There's a hero. If you look inside your heart, you don't have to be afraid of what you are. Lord knows the dreams are hard to follow, but don't let anyone, anyone tell them. My name is Tosaomi Ada. I am 22 years old. I am a graduate of Delta State University, Abraka. The song I chose for my semifinals is Skyscraper by Demi Lovato. I am going to give my all and all and all and all to make sure that the judges love it so I can get into the academy. You guys are crying, I am watching. Catching teardrops in my hands Only silence has its ending Like we never had a chance Go run, run, run I'm gonna stay right here Watch you disappear Yeah, hi. Go run, run, run Yeah, it's a long way down But I am closer to the clouds of here can take everything I have. You can break everything I am. Like a made of glass. Uh, like a made of paper. Oh, go on and try to tear me down. I will be rising from the ground. Like a skyscraper. Yeah. Like a skyscraper. Like a skyscraper, like a skyscraper, like a skyscraper. Hi, my name is Dende Okubajo. In the semifinals, I'm looking to sing No Woman Who Cry by Bob Marley. And I chose that song because it has the kind of vibe that I love. Hello world, please watch out for me, Dende and be sure that I'm gonna give you excitement, laughter, and I'm gonna rock your world, I promise you. I remember when we used to see, oh, in the government yard in Trench Town. See, Abba Abba serving the hypocrites as they would mingle with the good people. We Forget 
wash your past. No, no. So try your tears. I said, everything's gonna be alright. Now everything's gonna be alright. Everything's gonna be alright now. Everything's gonna be alright. So no woman, no cry. Say no woman. Hi, I'm Amakran Tumakumi from Ghana. I'll be singing um, Rolling in the Deep by Adele. I hope to bring out every emotion and every voice, no restraints, but singing right from the heart. I'm here to tell you that I'm not going to let you down on my part. I'm going to fight, fight with everything I have so that the best can come out of this. Pitch and it's bringing me out the dark. Finally, I can see you crystal clear. Go ahead and sell me out, and I'll lay your stuff there. The scars of your love remind me of us. They keep me thinking that we almost had it all. The scars of your love, they leave me breathless. I can't. My name is Henry Olamide Odulami. I'm 21. I'm a Nigerian. The song I'm going to sing for my semi-final is You and I by John Legend. I chose the song because the song is trying to explain how there is someone for everyone, you know, like me, there's someone for me. I'm still going to meet her in future. You stop the room when we walk in. Spotlights on, everybody's staring And this evening I won't let the feeling down Never want to leave your side Out of all of the girls, you're my one and only girl Ain't nobody in the world tonight I'm Lily Ogechi Udomoku. I'm 26 years old. I attended the University of Miami and studied engineering physics. Hello, family and friends, both in Nigeria and abroad. Thank you for all your love. Thank you for your support and your prayers. And I really appreciate you. I want to love you 
and treat you right. I want to love you every day and every night. We'll be together with the roof right over our heads. We'll share the shelter of one single bed. Hello, people. My name is Richard Tay. Um, all the way from Ghana, Accra, representing North K. And um, I love music. West Africa, watch out for me. Boy, oh, yeah, listen. Saturday morning, jumped out of bed and put on my best suit. It got in my car and raced like a jet yeah, all the way mm -hmm. to you. And knocked on your door with a heart in my hand. To ask you a question, cause I know that you're an old fancy man, yeah. Oh. Can I have your daughter for the rest of my life? Say yes, say yes, cause I need to know. You say I never get your blessings to the day I die. Tough luck, my friend, but the answer is no. So why you gotta be so rude? And don't you know I'm human too, yeah. So why you gotta be so rude? Say, I married that girl, we'll be a family, yeah. So why you gotta be so rude? Oh, why you gotta be so rude? I'm gonna marry you anyway, yeah, yeah. My name is Ojigoro Ogene Tejiri. I'm 21 years old. I am a Nigerian citizen. I studied electrical electronics engineering at Afe Babalola University, and I graduated with a first class. For my semi-final, I chose Try It On My Own by Whitney Houston. And I chose that song because that, it basically uh, describes me, basically defines me. I'm here and I'm trying it on my own. And I know that it's a song that also shows my vocal range and um, it shows my voice perfectly. So that's why I chose the song. In West Africa, watch out for me. Longer now, I've learned from my mistakes which way to go. And I should know, I never had the chance to do things my way. My name is Dipo and um, I am on MTN Project Film Season 8 by God's Grace. I am here to reach out to all of you through my music and I'm working hard to make you all proud. Please keep praying and keep supporting me in any way that you can through your prayers, through your votes, and I promise that I will make you proud. I pack my bags, I'm leaving town, I bought a one-way ticket. I ain't coming back It's goodbye friends And goodbye folks I'm headed for the city And 
that's my home I've heard about life in the city See that's where all dreams come true I'm gonna walk hard in the city So wish me Wish me well, well, please wish me well. Um, Dick Ball, um, you have a very, very interesting um, timbre. I, I really like it, and that's what caught my attention immediately when you started singing. Now, the problem is that I don't know if what happened, but it just started kind of like declining. Um, what you need to understand here is that um, sometimes, I won't even say you played safe because I don't think you played safe. You gave it your all. But maybe you should have been a bit more focused because there's a song I believe with your voice you can carry and there's, there's a bit of vo vocal dexterity going on in that song itself. I know the original and we know the people who wrote it and who composed it. So there's a lot expected of the vocalist and that's what makes it interesting. And you didn't quite deliver that. So I'm a bit disappointed. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you um, Dick Hi, people. My name is Deborah Ohiri Debbie. I'm here at the NTN Project Fame season 8.0 to win the money and not go home tomorrow. I'll be performing if Infinities Aeole. Um, I intend not to take too much from the original song, but just add a little of Debbie to the song and make it appealing. Please watch out for me and continue to pray for me. I love you guys. Kopetiti be o kun fo ti o sa sa o ti to wa laaye igbagbo ni orisu o un gbogbo oni suru ape ko to je ko ni je ba je ai mani suru lo mu are ni bo wa debi for jure wo mi ore kolu wa le for jure wo e abi ko ti da bi e ninu aye mi oh aye yi ko male o aye o le fe ni to ni gbagbo pa aye o le oh I 
I'm backstage with the top 24, and it is the top 24 final heat show. And as you can see, some of the contestants have already performed, but some of them are still eagerly waiting to wow the judges. And I'm sitting next to Chike. Chike, I got that right, yes? Yes. Yes. How are you doing? I'm fine. That's you are fine. He has like this cool demeanor. Like the whole time he's just composed. Have you performed in front of other people a lot? Yes, I have. Okay, so what are you planning on doing to wow the judges? Well, I intend to show um, the texture in my voice okay. and, you know, feel the song. Okay, and what song are you going to be performing? Everybody Knows by John Legend. Everybody Knows by John Legend. So what do you do in life? What's your actual job? What are you doing? Um, right now I'm job hunting. I just finished my YouTube. service. Okay, good for so, you. Good. He's a, you know, former Ajuaya. Hopefully, you know, your experience in the jungle will give you the confidence to wow the judges. This is Project Fame West Africa season eight. Chike is gonna go in and he's gonna perform very shortly. You don't wanna miss it. We're gonna find out if he actually can sing as well as he has all this confidence. Stick around, we'll be right back. My name is Chike, I'm 22 years of age, I'm a Nigerian. I'm hoping as you guys watch the show, that you get to vote for me, that you get to support me, you know, even in my best and my woes, that you really, really get to support me. It's written all over my face that I can't function the same when you're not here. Calling your name, but no one's there. And I hope someday you see who is that you could understand. I'm just an ordinary man. Wish that we had no wish that we had known. Cause everybody knows. Nobody really knows how to make it work or how to ease the heart. We've heard it all before and everybody knows just how to make it right. Wish we gave it one more try. My name is Steven Sakito Klete, a Ghanaian. I'll be doing Have I Told You Lately That I Love You by Rod Stewart. And the plan for performing this song is to bring out the uniqueness in my voice so I can make it to the next level. Charlie, what's up? As I come here, I will work hard to see I will make count for you guys. Make you guys watch out for me before music. Black Have I told you lately that I love you? Have I told you? There's no one else above you. Fill my heart with gladness. Take away all my sadness. Ease my troubles, that's what you do. That's a love that's divine. And it's yours and it's mine. Like the sun, like the sun. Oh, at the end of the day, we should give back some praise to the one, to the one. Fill my heart with gladness. Take away all my sadness. Ease my troubles. That's what you do. Oh, ease my troubles. That's what you do. My name is Anderson Emmanuel Amos. I'm 21 years old, student studying international relations at Egypt Africa University, Kotonou. The song I've chosen to sing for my semi-finals um, is Hallelujah by Alexandra Burke. Um, it's, a, it's pretty much a very, very, you know, emotional song, but it's a song that shows, that gets, helps me to show all my strengths and, you know, 
just express myself musically. A big shout out to my family, my friends, my brother, my sister, my niece, everybody watching from all over the world, from West Africa and Africa generally. Uh, I just want to say one love, man. Thank you so much. I hope you guys are supporting and loving you. Thank you very much. There was a secret court that David played, and it pleased the Lord. But you don't really care for music, do you? Maybe there's a God above, but all I ever learned from love is how to shoot somebody who I'll drew you it's not a cry that you hear at night it's not someone who's seen the light it's a cold and a broken hallelujah Everyone. My name is Bamike Olaomi. I am 26 years old. I'm Nigerian from Ogun State. The song I chose for my semi-final is Eya Daba by Asha because the song says a new dawn has come and let the dove patch on me. Yeah, for the Yoruba speaking people. In summary, that's what it means. And I just hope that the judges will be able to connect with the purpose why I chose that song and that they will completely love me. Hello family, friends and fans at home. I hope to not let you down. Watch out for me, vote when necessary. I love you all and I hope to see you guys at the top. Bye for now. <laughs> Morire o Hoje matimo Hoje matimo mi Nele io Hoje matimo My name is Amina Yusuf. To my friends, to my family, to my fans out there, I'm assuring you, like for real, I'm assuring you that I've come here to stay and just pray for me and that's all I need from you guys. Change 
all my colors for you. I don't really need to look very much further. I don't want to have to go where you won't follow. I will know the back again, the special inside. Can run from myself, there's nowhere to Comfort Ulua from Layo Arewa. The name of the song I'm performing for the semi-finals is called I Was Here by Beyonce. And I am gonna perform this song with the whole of my heart. Watch out for Comfort Ulua from Layo Arewa. I'm coming out strong in Project Fame, West Africa, season eight. I wanna leave my footprints on the sand of time. No, there was something there, meant something there. I left behind. When I leave this world, I'll leave no regret. Leave something to remember, so they won't forget I was here. I lived. Everything that I wanted, he was more than I thought it would be. I will leave my mark so everyone will know I was Adira Ibe. I'm 21 years old. I'm from Imo State, Nigeria. So the song I'm going to be singing for my semi-finals is Jela by Asha. I chose this song because it's something I'm comfortable doing and I think I do well and I really just enjoy singing and I really like the instrumentals that go with it. So I think it's a song that makes me comfortable and also makes me able to express myself. I want to give a shout out to all my friends, family and loved ones. Thank you guys so much for your support. I'll make sure I keep working hard so that you guys will be proud of me. I'm in chains and you're in chains too. I wear uniform, you self wear uniform too. I'm a prisoner, you're a prisoner too. Mr. Jailer, you see, if you walk in in a marketplace, don't throw stones. Even if you do, you just my hate one of your own. Life is not about your policy all the time. 
So you better rearrange your philosophy and be good to your fellow man. My name is Amadi Jennifer and I live in Lagos. I'm doing a song by Celine Dion titled Only One Road. I hope it takes me to the academy. Hello West Africa, hello Nigeria, hello Lagos. I want to give a very big shout out to everyone out there who knows me. I'll make you all proud and show you that have what it takes to actually be the next MTM Project Fame winner. Looking back through the years down this highway Memories, they all lead up to this one thing We say goodbyes but our hearts did not hear no. There's nothing left to fear Wait on my heart, put me through It leads me back to you My name is Joy Chukuma from Maduna Investing. I studied public administration. I'll be singing Turn Your Life Down Low by Bob Marley featuring Lauren Hills. I chose that song because of the swagaliciousness in that song. It's really an old music and I really love the music. And I think it will bring out my, you know, my swag. Turn your lights down low, yeah. And open your window curtain, yeah. Oh, let the moon come shining in into our lives again. Saying, ooh, it's been a long, long, long time. Still, I got this message for you, boy. Listen. Huh. Though it seems I was never on time, yeah. Still, I want to get through to you, boy. Yeah. On time. On time. Listen. I want to give you some love. Love. My name is Olama Pearl Awa Agu. I'm 21 years old. I'm about to turn 21. And um, I'm a graduate of the University of Nigeria in Suka. It's going to be hard, but I think I'm 
up to the task. When I think of you Welcome back. It is the final heat show, and we have seen 24 performances. Now, the judges are going to give their verdict any moment from now. While the judges of the round table do their thing, for the benefit of those who are just joining us, here are the highlights of what we just witnessed. There's beauty up above, and things we never take notice of. Won't you help to sing? Freedom. Everything's gonna be alright. Now everything's gonna be alright. I want to give you some love. Love. I want to give you some good, good loving. I'm gonna marry you and away. I married that girl. Marry you and away. I married that girl. Hello. Just got to let you know All my soul is dying And then a hero comes along With the strength to carry on You can take everything I have You can break everything
nervous. Take a seat. I liked, we personally, I liked, and I think my colleagues as well, liked most of the interpretations that we saw this evening coming from you. Obviously, we were looking at it from a very critical point of view. And as a matter of fact, there's one that really stood out for us, isn't there, T.Y. Mix? We'd like to actually probably take a look yeah. at even. <laughs> but I'd like to see, um... The Jeff's, Jeff's, uh, Jeff's performance. Can we just see can Jeff's, we see uh, Jeff's performances? Performance. So you can take a look at. Okay. Ty, do you wanna? Can you see? All right. Now that performance was really very, very. Uh, it was very unique. It was very original. Um, you you came in doing something that we nobody and we didn't in our wildest dreams anticipate that you were going to do redemption song that way. Actually, your inter interpretation too was quite original, given that you know we weren't expecting you to um, to come out singing a Bob Marley dressed in a suit, and that was very original as well. Your interpretation too was extraordinary because you came out and uh, sunk it completely with. Uh, that number you did, um, skyscraper. That was and, and that was extra. And then your dexterity as well was like uh, so. Your potentials, your 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 unified potentials were extraordinary. So now we're here to give you the verdict of what we think. Uh, all four of you: Arewa, Jeff, Ada, Dende. I don't know how to share this with you guys. So yes. Yeah, I want to keep the suspense a bit. Look at your worried expression. Yeah, all four of you just made it through. Oh my God, you're great! <laughs> it's a yes, yes. I'm very, I'm very excited. So as it stands right now, we have um, two young ladies who are definitely in and two young ladies who are not in this year, but who could come back next year, given that they understand the game better now. All right, so on my chart here, I have, I'm gonna start with a bit of Ogechi. Okay, Ogechi, uh, unfortunately, given the circumstances you didn't make it through because of, I don't know, so many little things that were going on in you, not because of your voice, but maybe the interpretation of your voice today. Yeah. And um, I don't like to be the bringer of bad news, but you know, that's some like Bamile. Who's Bamike? Bamike. It's Bamike. You're Bamike. You didn't make it through either. That little moment you know, probably didn't make it through for you. But you two young ladies can smile all the way, all the way home today. So right now, um, the decision is this. Two of you have to, um, unfortunately, um, leave while two of you re will remain. You need a henchman, eh? Yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Okay, so on my list, on my Alvidas and goodbye list here, yeah, I've got Suspense. Esther. It's a no for me.
As we said, two people have to go. Henry. I'm sorry. We enjoyed your performance, but uh, unfortunately, we are not willing to let you go. So congratulations, you made it through. We're going to keep you around a bit longer. Congratulations. Miss Jacqueline. This is not your day to go home either. <laughs> we loved you. <laughs> Dorothy, that leaves you with a goodbye. Thank you, guys. Uh, we wish you the best of luck. I am happy. <laughs> so I say yes, thank you. Anderson, Biko, Mide, and Dikbo. It is a competition. Some people have to go home. That's the nature of the game. Yep and you all know what you signed up for. Well, sometimes I feel like, you know, um, some people are not meant, they're not competition material, you know, not because they're not good, you know, but because maybe they do not have the composure to compose themselves properly um, for an audition such as this. So, know. we're gonna take it from the guy who is not very sure of himself, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna tell you that you ought to be sure of yourself because you made it. Congratulations. Congratulations. But somebody so, has to go home, eh? Yeah, so who else wasn't sure of himself? Who wasn't sure? Were you sure? He wasn't. He wasn't sure. All uh, right, so, um, um, Deepo, right? Congratulations. You made <laughs> so you see, you must be trusting a little bit more in oh, yourself, huh? Okay, I get enough it. of goodies here. <laughs> Nico, do you have what it takes to be in this competition? Do you have what it takes? Unfortunately, this is not the end of your role. Because not as you realize what you said. You're still in. Yes. Okay. You're going to have to stick around a bit longer. Uh -huh. So who we got left here? Oh, we got Hallelujah, God. <laughs> <laughs> hallelujah. hallelujah, man. Yeah, hallelujah. We got Hallelujah, man. Mr. Hallelujah. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> Congrats. So all you four guys have to build a bit more confident because with your uncertainty, you really made it through. Yeah. So we're happy to have you on board. We, um, for us, it's a tough call. It's, it's actually a tough one. And ultimately, we're three people, so. Um, let's start with um, Tejiri. You got all the feedback you could get from all of us, right? And for me, I just wasn't that impressed. So, I still stand my grounds. I don't know how T.Y. sees it. Oh, we were a bit on the fence. I'm gonna let T.Y. tell you what we thought. Tejiri, we think that um, you need some more time to groom yourself. And um, you need some more level of, of exposure, you know, listen to materials, you know. I don't know who your influences are, but you need to work on yourself. And we're willing to help you do that. So congratulations, you made it through. Yeah, the Academy would help you harness that beautiful voice. Yeah. So you made it to the next round. Wish you all the best, huh? Yes. Carol, on the other hand, I don't know. You got a bit confusing. It got a yeah. bit. It was difficult with us for you, Pearl. Very because, tough. One. Yeah, Very because tough. you started off with a nice jazzy swing, and then all of a sudden you went somewhere else, and it was like it threw us off guard. 
but we had to keep on listening to your voice all the same, you know. So uh, you also have a really big uh, challenge, you know, to work on yourself. You see, that's my point exactly. That's why you need to go to I, the next I, stage. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Adora. Think about it. Um, I really like what you did, you know, in terms of um, claiming a song and the um, Jill Scott feel and kind of spoken word. That was very daring, you know, and exciting as well. Now, um, considering the fact that it is a competition and that um, there are people where we see potential, others where we, we kind of believe, okay, you know, we'll go back to the drawing boards, you know. It's, it's, um, it's a tough one here. But I, I definitely have my um, notes and my mind made. And I'd like to say welcome. And then we're left with um, Joy. Hey, Joy. Joy had like a very easy song. Here, Joy, right? man, you just came here and your audition was done, was it? You swagged your way through. I mean, like, it could be yes or no. It wouldn't matter, would it? Would it matter? You were? No, 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 don't do that. No, don't, don't do no, that. If you no, do no, no, that. No, 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 don't even Because do that. you tried it the last time and it was a decoy. So don't yeah, do that. Don't do that. It won't change our minds. Well, T.Y., what do you feel? Yeah. I feel, I feel joy. You need to go. How about to you? To the next level. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Joy. Congratulations, Joy. Joy. So, the three of you, through. You're not through simply because we needed to hear singing and we didn't get that too much. Not because you're bad, okay? Don't get that wrong. You need to harness your voice. Kumi, Richie, Chike, Amina. Okay, so you're the last batch. It's um, been a beautiful ride, and we've enjoyed a lot of your performances. Some were disappointing, I won't lie. It is about giving your all, it is a yeah. competition. It's about fun as well, taking a risk, you know. I mean, you're young, what, what do you have to lose? And, and I see that some of you come extremely prepared and some are just like, okay, I'll just wobble my way through and let's see how this goes, you know. You know, you can all judge your performances for yourselves. Okay, now, Richie, I know you're not expecting this because really, to be honest with you, we weren't really sure <laughs> what you could do other than reggae, all right? But there's something about the way in which you are a performer on stage, which is a bit interesting and exciting to find out what you could do given some work, given grooming, and given the push. So we've given you the opportunity to the next level, all right? So we hope you put it to good use. That's the easiest one so far. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. Sit, sit, sit. Uh, <laughs> I just don't know what to do with you, boy. You see, um, I was expecting a lot more. And I I just don't know. I was just, it got to a point that we've been deliberating and... Yeah. I think GK was too careful, you know. Are, are you sure you're ready for a competition? I don't know. Please answer just... me. Yes, I am. Are you sure? Yes, I, I don't think so. No, I don't, be, you know, I don't think you, you were this too, guy's ready you know, at all. You, you, you sang like you were in your living room. You sang like, you know, you know. You didn't give it your all. You see, you're, I don't even believe you're a fighter. T.Y. and I have been having this argument backstage, you know, and I'm like, you know what? I don't, I don't think he can, he can pull it off, you know? So if it's, I, 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 um, I just want to just say, you know what? Don't go, stay. 
Yeah. Stay and work it out. I want Ben to work. Okay, so now we're left with two more. Kumi, you know, um, we weren't really sure at a certain moment you were playing it extremely safe. When you started to sing, we heard, were hearing your voice, and then you went, you withdrew completely as though you were like singing to yourself and not wanting to come out. You're in a very high profile competition. If you get to this point, you've got to be singing out, darling. Otherwise, it's like, where are you? You want it, you don't want it. You want to be here, you don't want to be here. You want to be cute, you're not cute. You're a singer, you're not a singer. What is it? But you have a beautiful voice. And uh, same thing for Amina. You took a song that was very difficult to do. It was literally, it was li literally for you a struggle right through the song. So what do we do with you two? What? All right. So, um, what do we do? Kumi, right? I'll get back to you. I mean, uh, I'm sorry, Zeno. You didn't make it through, darling. Sorry, you didn't make it through. And Kumi, I'm sorry, same goes for you, but it's a yes. So, we're we'll giving you the opportunity to get out of your shell, Kumi. To get out of your shell and come and make us proud of you. We don't want shy babies here. Okay, we want singers that can move people. Good luck. Good luck. The next level. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome back. It has been a mixed bag of emotions on the show today. 24 took the stage, but now we have the top 18. But it doesn't end there, because only 14 of these 18 will be making it to the prestigious Project Fame Academy. That's right. Now the question is, which of them will it be? Well, find out next week Sunday when the opening gala of Project Fame West Africa hits your screen. Same time, same station. Trust me, you do not want to miss this. From us here at the Ultimate Studios, it is... Good night. Brought to you by MTN.